Hello beautiful people, my name is Namalina. I am very excited about today's video. I'll be giving you guys step-by-step -step directions, taking you guys from the car train station all the way to Small Street. So if you've always wanted to go to Small Street, but you don't know where it is, you don't know how to go there, and you're really looking for a safe way to get there, I highly recommend using the Khao train. The Khao train is very user-friendly for South Africans and even international visitors, and it's very safe. So please make sure you get off at park station that is where we are going to start our journey i'm really excited guys so without any further ado let's get right into it so guys this is what it kind of looks like this is the how train station you want to get off at park station um yeah you want to get off at park station and that's just kind of idea of what it looks like you're going to cross the road we are going to be walking alongside these light blue fences this is in wall Marin's street okay so the light blue fences when you get out from the car train station at park station please make sure you get off at the correct place um then you're gonna walk alongside the blue fences now with the how train the staff is trained really really well guys you will not get lost if you use your mouth communicate with the staff and they'll definitely help you out okay so we're gonna walk straight just straight alongside these blue fences keep on this blue side and we are actually going to turn here at the corner please ignore this man who is peeing in public i really don't know why people do that like honestly guys like yantena, like yo yambora. Anyway, so you're gonna continue walking straight. So once you're by the blue fences, you're going to turn right, continue walking, and you're going to see taxis on one side, and then you're going to see these tents, mobile being depleted. Okay, so where they are cooking plates and they're selling um items such as fruits and other items. Okay, so you're also going to see the sign that says Leeds Street, or is it Leeds? I really don't know, guys. But you're going to continue walking straight. In this road now this road is kind of dirty okay and you really don't want to come to this area looking too nice I know for some people they do come to this area and they don't have an issue but personally for me I don't feel comfortable telling you guys to look nice you want to look like you sleep here that's what I look like when I come here okay so I would advise you guys to do the same but other people claim that they come here looking normal and they don't have an issue. As for me, I am not doing that, okay? That's just not what I'm doing. Okay, so you're going to continue walking straight and you're going to pass this taxi area. It's a taxi rank. And once you get to this taxi area, if you look to your left, like once you've crossed the entrance of this taxi area, if you look to your left, um, you will see that there's a little part that I'm going to jump onto. And you actually want to move on over to your left, okay? Because we're going to be turning left. So as you guys can see, I'm moving over to my left. I like to walk on this little thing, but you don't have to, obviously. Then you're going to move left again. Now that we're on the left, we're going to continue going straight, okay? Continue going straight. Um, I don't think the grandpa poster will still be there when you guys see this video, so I don't want you guys to, like, remember this part with it. But once you get to this part, you want to turn left again, okay? So you want to make sure that you cross first, then you turn left, okay? Make sure that you cross first, then you turn left, because on the left side of this, um, once you're here, on the left side of this, it's like markets and little shops over there. So I want you guys on this side. So you'll be on the right side of the road. Okay. From here, guys, we're going to continue walking straight. You guys can take note of these shops. Normally, these shops will not spend money in changing their poster again. So that should remain the same. Even if you're watching this two or three years later, they normally don't change their posters, honestly. 
Um, but like the advertisers do change their poster. So that grandpa poster might not be there anymore. So you're going to actually pass this place called Just On Cosmetics. And by it, there is a place where people sell items. I'm going to quickly just go in and show you guys some of the items that they sell. Um, just for any of you guys who've been looking for a place like this, just to give you guys an idea of the items that are available for sale in this area. Okay, this is just as you are walking to the cosmetics shop. Okay, so you're not going to turn here if you're not looking to buy anything there, obviously. You are literally just going to continue in the street that I showed you. So you're going to pass the cosmetic shop. You're not going to enter the Dunosa place over there unless you want something. If you don't want anything, just continue straight, okay? You're going to pass the cosmetic shop. It's the Dunosa place. Then it's the cosmetic shop. It's blue. And you're just going to continue walking straight okay guys if you walk straight it'll be it'll be easy for you guys there is a tavern on a tavern you saw okay so you can look out for this i'm pretty sure that's not going to change the tavern you know it's just that thing it's 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 like uh what do they call those it's like a monument mugasi in these places so i highly doubt that's gonna shut down anytime soon unfortunately yeah Anyway, so then you'll walk straight and then you will see a KFC. Okay, more KFC, Skabawa Terra right. You're just going to continue walking straight. Okay, guys, walk straight like a Lashole. Just continue walking straight. Now, while you're marching like the soldier that you are, you will see a shop called Fast Track. Um, I don't know if this will still be there in three or four years. I'm not trying to be shady, but I'm just saying, I don't know how long they will last. Okay, let me stop being shady. Let's remember this area with the gray wall and with the brown and white painting at the bottom. Okay, please don't bump into people's kids. They allow them to just run around everywhere. So watch your step, darling. Okay, so we're going to continue walking straight. You will see other shops like MRP. Just when walk, walk, walk straight, and then you will actually see this little, I don't know, getting police that are camping, and there's a butchery. You want to turn right there. I don't know what these. You know, let me keep quiet. <laughs> okay, you're gonna turn right over there, and we're gonna rawa boxer. Okay, so from here you want to continue walking straight now i don't know if you guys are gonna see it but there's a man who's on his phone um please do not be fooled by select people who are on their phones in these areas do not do that if you do not need your phone in these areas that i'm going to be showing you guys don't bring it okay if you need to have your phone there and you have an option between your fancy phone and little bot botwana or you know those small cheap phones Use that, darling. Don't bring, don't bring your iPhone here, okay? So you're going to walk straight. Then you will see a shell garage. You're going to turn right here, okay? Don't go into the shell garage. Don't. Just turn right. When you turn right over here, you're going to continue walking straight, and you will actually be at the back of MTN. So these are the taxis that you can use to go back. Um, let's say you're from Pretoria. You will find your taxis here to go back to Pretoria if you do not want to use the Khao train to go back. If you want to use the Khao train, great. You'll just reverse, you know, this video. But if you want to use taxis to go back, this is where the taxis are. Also, if you use a taxi, let's say, then from Bosman, you can use a taxi from MTN. You can use a taxi from Bosman. You can use a taxi from Bosman. You can use MTN. Eh, sorry, go go na meji taxi from eh uh, kwa kwa uh, from Polokwane. Then ukana wana mela how train? Eh how se bossman? So the taxi ja Polokwane ja gota Pretoria. Do follow she bossman. From bossman, ukana waya how train? How train? Eh how se bossman? From how train? Do no follow ga gona mo wa shela mara go video. O simple, okay? The, that's just for you know my family members, people from Limpopo, okay? So from there you're gonna walk right through the taxi rank, and you will see that there's this part where the taxis curve. Um, this is where I like to just go into the next street, but obviously you can cross wherever you want to cross, and most taxis 
will drop you off here if you say you're going to MTN. So if you're not using the Khao train and you are using a taxi that's going to drop you at MTN, they're going to drop you here, okay, by the taxis where you saw the big banner here, yeah, MTN. I don't know if MTN is like paying royalties to taxi drivers or something because... I mean, we, we keep saying MTN. Anyway, so from there, you're going to go straight and you're going to pass um, Arthur Ford um, Perfumes and you'll see Africa Mall, Joburg Mall and Pan African Mall as well. You will also see that there is a KFC here and a Mad Max. From Mad Max, why well, want a Mad Max come on left? You can turn and cross the road, okay? You don't have to go to the KFC like I did and cross the road. Now, guys, Pan African Mall, Joburg Mall, all of these little malls, this is a hustler's paradise. If you guys want a video about these places inside, showing you guys what it looks like inside, let me know. Just comment down below and I'll literally make a video for you guys. Um, but as you guys will see, it's very busy. So from any of those three, right, you want to enter and go right through to the other side. When you get to the other side, turn right. Now, guys, this part is super, super busy, okay? This is back-to-back Ratula Namo, and this is why you need to be wearing tackies or some form of closed shoe. If you can wear boots, wear boots. Guys, observe what people are wearing in these spaces, and it will give you an idea of how you should be dressed, okay? You don't see anyone wearing heels here. You don't see anyone wearing clip clips because it's not a place for that. People are going to stamp on you. Guys, you need to be comfortable. You need to be comfortable and you need to blend in. Please, guys, you need to blend in. Okay, so you're just going to continue walking straight. Don't get distracted, darling. We're going to Small Street today. Don't get distracted. There are other places here as well. If you guys want me to show you guys a few of the places in this space, let me know in the comment section so I can just show you guys like what's going on over here. I was using a specialized camera for this content because I am a black female darling. I'm an endangered species as is. So going to Johannesburg CBD with a camera um, would just put my life at like major risks. More risk than I already am on a daily basis. Um, so please do excuse like how the camera is positioned. But this is literally how it is, guys. Ratula namu. Okay, it is hectic. So you can imagine if somebody is your runner. For those of you who have runners, this is what they're experiencing, guys. And then that time, mututuere your money, your list of specific items that you want. And then they're also carrying the items that they purchased for you, bulk items. And ratula na wanaka mkho. Guys, ro hectic. Ro H for hectic. Okay, anyway, so we're going to continue going straight. And you're going to cross the road. Please, guys, take note of the different shops around. You can see over here there's Boliana Fashion. Um, you want to just go straight. Do not turn, okay? Please, guys, when you are here in CBD, <sighs> the robots don't work. Like, they work, okay? But, like, taxi drivers just pass whenever they feel like it. So, don't just rely on the um, robots or, as we would say, traffic lights don't rely on those there is a plus size shop here um it's really great for anybody who's looking for plus size items okay so we're going to continue walking straight just straight 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 guys um there are tons and tons of shops on the sides that you guys can go into and up there is the golden arches and that is mcdonald's when you see the golden arches in the sky guys this means you have made it to small streets so congratulations for making it this far okay so if you ever need a toilet if you ever need to rest if you ever need to check your phone there is a mcdonald's and a kfc go into those next to mcdonald's and kfc there's a shop called bafana bafana okay I just want to take you inside this particular sh sh um, store of theirs. They have bags and shoes in the store. And I just wanted to give you guys like a little idea 
of the items that they have available guys i was using a specialized camera for um this video so i do apologize that i do not have the prices like i normally do with my other videos please bear with me i am doing my best so you guys can see there is mcdonald's come on next door there's kfc and then right there on the left is bafana bafana shoes and bags so if you're looking for shoes and bags you can go there okay so when are you going to be standing here by McDonald's, by DSV. You see that DSV? And you're going to cross the road. And when you cross the road, darling, look at that. You are at Small Street. Okay, guys? So this is what Small Street looks like. You just continue walking straight, straight, straight. There are shops on your left. There are shops on your right. There are shops in the middle of the street. And there are shops that walk around. Those would be people who are just like walking around selling perfumes. Please, guys, do not talk to anyone. Do not talk to anyone. Anyone who stops you, darling, you better keep walking, okay? Be very, very alert. Um, keep an eye out on your bag. And yeah, guys, this is a small street. So guys, let me know down in the comment section if you guys want a part two of this video where I go into these shops at small street and show you guys what the latest items are. And just to give you guys an idea of the different types of items that are available in these small street shops. Let me know, guys. I'm a woman of my word. I did tell you guys once that I would love to make a video about Maravastat. I did. If you have not watched that, I have a video that shows you guys exactly what Maravastat looks like. And if you guys want any other videos, go into the comment section. Let me know. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm not going to continue talking. I'm going to let you guys enjoy the walkthrough. <laughs> So tender, 